Understanding, Resist Autocracy, an English Language Learning Guide. Hello everyone and welcome to our English Learning Channel. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting and powerful phrase, Resist Autocracy. This topic is not only important for understanding English better but also for gaining insights into global political and social contexts. So, let's dive in and unravel the meaning and usage of resist autocracy. Resist and autocracy are two words with strong meanings. Resist means to refuse to accept or to fight against something. It implies standing up against an action or a force. On the other hand, autocracy refers to a system of government where one person has absolute power. It is often associated with a lack of democracy and individual freedom. So, when combined, resist autocracy means to oppose or stand against a system where one person or a group holds total power. It's a call to action encouraging people to not accept an autocratic rule and to strive for democratic values. Understanding any phrase in English requires knowing its context. Resist autocracy is often used in political contexts. It's a slogan you might find in protests, political discussions, or writings advocating for democracy and human rights. The phrase can also appear in historical contexts, referring to past struggles against authoritarian regimes. The context not only clarifies the meaning but also the tone and seriousness of the phrase. In a democratic society, using resist autocracy might reflect a commitment to preserving freedom, whereas in a more authoritarian context, it could be a bold and risky statement. Let's see how resist autocracy can be used in sentences. 1. The protesters' main message was clear. Resist autocracy. 2. In her speech, the activist emphasized the need to resist autocracy to maintain our freedoms. 3. Historical examples show us the importance of the call to resist autocracy. Notice how the phrase can be used as a standalone statement or as part of a larger sentence, carrying a strong and persuasive meaning. I hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, resist autocracy, and its significance in both language and society. Remember, learning a language is not just about words, but also about the ideas and history they convey. Keep exploring and questioning as you learn. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.